Adam Levine kept a low profile in a baseball cap, graphic t-shirt with a snarling dog on it and a pair of baggy black shorts while running errands around Santa Barbara. In a rare public outing since a TikTok user alleged she had a year-long affair with him, the 43-year-old frontman of Maroon 5 appeared relaxed as he walked to his car. He was still wearing his wedding band following the claims from multiple women that he cheated on his wife Beati Prinsloo, who is pregnant with their third child. Last month, the father of two admitted to sending flirty text messages to model Sumner Stroh, 23. Sumner shocked the internet when she went on TikTok and shared intimate messages between herself and the singer. The video clip featured flirtatious messages and suggestions of in-person meetings and in the snippets Drew said she felt manipulated by the pop star. Essentially, I was having an affair with a man who's married to a Victoria's Secret model. At the time, I was young, I was naive and, quite frankly, I feel exploited, she said. I wasn't in the scene like I am now, so I was definitely very easily manipulated. Stroh also claimed that Levine indicated his relationship with Prince Lou was on rocky ground, but then the supermodel announced she was pregnant with their third child, suggesting the relationship was on stronger ground that she had been led to believe. After the pregnancy was announced, Levine allegedly told his alleged mistress that he wanted to potentially name the child after her. Following the revelation, Levine shared a post addressing the cheating rumors, admitting that he crossed the line with his sexts and other messages. I used poor judgment in speaking with anyone other than my wife in any kind of flirtatious manner, the musician said. I did not have an affair, nevertheless, I crossed the line during a regrettable period of my life. In certain instances it became inappropriate. I have addressed that and taken proactive steps to remedy this with my family. He continued, my wife and my family is all I care about in this world. To be this naive and stupid enough to risk the only thing that truly matters to me was the greatest mistake I could ever make. I will never make it again. I take full responsibility. We will get through it and we will get through it together.